Right now in our schools, Frederick County Public Schools may be seeing an increase in enrollment, but they are seeing a decrease in the amount of money they can spend on programs and staffing. And our Michaela Newton really tells us why it's because they know they now have to make up about $33 million in the Board of Education's budget. In order to make up millions of dollars, the Frederick County Board of Education is cutting the expansion of some special education services, as well as slowing down staffing of school personnel. The FCPS Board of Education needs to cut $33 million in proposed spending in order to meet next year's budget. According to Sue Johnson, Board of Education president, it all boils down to a lack of funding, inflation, growth in the school system, and an ongoing need to expand special education services. I don't feel like we're getting the funding to provide excellence in education. Now the school system has to make budget cuts, getting rid of some of their programs like the blended virtual learning program for first and second grade and Elevate Academy. It's clear that we were not treating our special education students the way they should have been treated. So I kind of feel like they're getting the short end of the stick again. The FCPS board will discuss the budget in a special June 7th meeting. The Frederick County Public Schools could receive an additional $14 million through a proposal submitted to the county council from the county executive to help offset the budget shortfall. In a statement, the county executive said in part, with this supplemental budget, I'm proposing to hold FCPS harmless from a state decision and to mitigate the effects of a passive premium increase on your employees and retirees. The supplemental budget vote is expected to take place next week. Reporting in Frederick County, Maryland, I'm Michaela Newton for DC News Now.